My apologies, Miss Morimura. Oh no. <laughs> Making arrangements in 1985 proved somewhat difficult. I'm sorry we've had to remain here the past few days. Not much we can do if it's an emergency. Hmm. I have to ask. Was it absolutely necessary to dress me up like this? <laughs> Why? Considering the age you appear, well, it struck Does me as the most look like that? choice. <sighs> Why indeed? How did they do that? And why? You're not having trouble walking, are you, Miss Morimura? You should probably just call me Chihiro. Otherwise, we'll seem suspicious in public. Okay, Chihiro. The sun. Better drop the sun, too. Dramatic glasses removal. What is happening? You ain't talking like an eight-year-old. Well, duh. That's that's Miss Morimura. She's made to look like a child somehow. I found records that your mind like, been transferred. It's her avatar into the young in a simulation. Or her mind got transferred into a child. Yeah. That's terrible. This body is a juvenile clone of me. Clone, you say? Clone, you say? We're committing the crimes now. <laughs> <laughs> So that's a clone of Chihiro Muramura, aged, what, five, six? Yeah. That now has the full grown adult Chihiro Muramura's mind inside of it. This is. I ran an experiment to see if I could restore my compatibility. It turned out to be a failure. Restore your compatibility... ...with the Sentinels is my assumption. Yeah, compatibility with what? That's why I sealed my memories. Ha! Iori? That ability. That'd be the ability to control the gate and the sentinels? You need compatibility to control the mainframe. I was once compatible myself. But after everything got rewound, I lost that power. Maybe it's hard for you to see how crucial that ability is. But you'll understand soon enough. Hmm. I'm forming the connections. I just can't put it into words. Connecting the dots. La 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 la. <laughs> Four in a row. That one's serpentine. <laughs> Serpentine, serpentine, sorry, 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 serpentine. What's going on with my actual body? She's acting like a completely different person. Hmm. My theory is that someone's taken control of her. Iori? So her actual body is no longer Chihiro Morimura, at least not with this memory set. That's what I'm getting out of this. You're saying she got mind hacked? 
She's clearly behaving very differently, at least. Men talk, the fine taker. It seems like she's working <laughs> against the Sentinel project. It's like she's been influenced by 426. Or the man himself may just be wearing her face. Mm. She, she was running around with Izumi. Yep. <sighs> Not much to go on, though. Either way, we'll have to do some more investigation. I can see it's been quite a while since my memories were sealed. Five whole years. And now four sectors have gone dark. Talk about a rude awakening. Sectors. Yeah. Time periods where the world ended. Yeah. First, you'd better catch me up on major developments in the last five years. Easy Did we enough. find out what they say about dwarves? Hardly we did not. Surroundings for a briefing, though. Fuck. I'll explain over in 1985. Which would be the last surviving sector at this point, then. Yep. So it's official. The time periods are sectors. That should do it for preparations. Now. Let's see if the biometric authentication works. Interact. Nope, cannot interact with the laptop on the floor. So yeah, whatever. You unlock Goto's chapters, there tends to be a lot to unpack in them. Yeah. Hmm. Looks like that got me past the initial barrier, at least. Now, with Miss Murimura's ID, I should be able to get into her logs. Found it. One of the logs she left behind. Today's date is March 2nd, 2100. Well, I guess there's no point in putting a date to these logs. They've probably got four years left until the invasion begins. I ran an experiment on my clone. I wanted to see if I could make her more compatible. I had more than enough data stored in Sector Zero. Sector Zero? Yeah. Which one is that? All we know is it's somehow connected to, like, being able to go through multiple loops. See, my guess is we've seen a grand total of six eras in this game so far. We have seen the 1940s, we've seen the 1980s, we've seen mm -hmm. the 2020s, the 2060s, the 2100s, and then the 2188 era. The only one that hasn't gotten a number yet is the 2188 era. So that's Sector Zero. So until further evidence, I'm I'm calling it Sector Zero. Mm -hmm. Which I may get overturned on that very quickly, but she would have had all my memories. <laughs> However, I could not establish compatibility in the clone. No more than I could in myself. Hey, Lancer, have we yet gotten to the thing that you called 30 seconds before it happened? We have not. Maybe. Okay. I, I will tell you when we get there. Uh -huh. Because okay. again, it's going to be really funny. <laughs> not even Ida Kuhn knows about this experiment. Good. I've kept this attempt a secret from everyone. The memories I implanted in the clone have been sealed. 
I left her in 1940 under the Miura family's care. The Miura family? Yep, that Kentaro's little sister. Is oh, a clone. Right. Yep. Yep. And, oh, okay. And then ends up with uh, Rinya when Kentaro sees him in the park. And then what you've seen here. She'll be able to grow uh. up as her own person. Someone separate from me. Yeah, about that. Until they invade, at least. I'm... <laughs> huh. Wait, so is the is 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 the clone Does the clone grow up to become a Yuri or are there two Chihiros walking around? Well, we'll have to see, won't we? Huh. That methodology sounds familiar. Was she basing this project off of those memory overriding crime reports? He's weirdly All calm about effort this. To achieve compatibility? Yeah, that's so compatibility Godo in general. A matter of differences he in doesn't seem to panic too much. Alright. Alright. This refers to the humans who can control the UFO's mainframe. Those compatible have nanomachines implanted in their bodies. There's more. Can't hear. This file looks like the last thing recorded. Peter Kuhn didn't make it back either. The remaining sentinels are infected. No good to us. We're running out of options. We'll have to resort to Operation Aegis. If we go that route, we'll be risking the future of humanity itself. How do I make the call on a decision like that? But... I don't know how else he and I can survive this. Hmm? This is my only chance. Aegis Rin. Yep. Ever since the battle that ended with the Sentinels infected, Miss Morimura has been pushing this operation as one of its fiercest supporters. Final log that Chihiro Morimura left on the UFO. She speaks at length on Operation Aegis. Her goal is that he and she would ultimately survive, even at the cost of humanity's future. The question is, who is he? Puzzling. There's a log registered under my name. As far as I know, I've never recorded anything like this. Mm hmm. Renya Goto speaking. Oh. Elf, there you go. I is. was right! Yep. I was right! Yep. I was right! Yeah, I, I didn't even bother writing a note about that one. Yeah, I mean, <laughs> we both kind of looked at that and went, that could be one of, that could be either one of those two standing right there. <laughs> I, I was like, the glasses are the exact same. That's yeah. probably a coincidence. I still count it. <laughs> and I'm sure you can see to the details. Am I clear? I want her dead. Any means necessary. Huh. Chihiro? Chihiro would be my best guess. Execute her. And stop the project. Chihiro. That's not my problem. It's in your hands now. I also have a note from earlier about Surat is right that cloning is featured. You know what must be done. 
Did we get to the thing I was worried about? <laughs> no, I- Yeah, yeah. <laughs> I didn't want to be right about cloning being featured. <laughs> you know how much more convoluted that can make every single thing here? Eh, 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 eh. It just made everything so much more goddamn convoluted because anyone could be a goddamn clone of anyone else. And then it's like, which, which version of this person did that? Was it the original or the clone? Executive from the year 2188. Is that supposed to be my future? Well, the question Seems is, like a private communication who was he block. talking to? A. A killed Chihiro. I think he was talking to Tetsuya. I mean, A is also very likely, but it's just... Given the interactions we've seen between Tetsuya and A... I'm just kind of wondering, it's like, ah, did you... Say... Because there was also something about receipt of payment in there. Hmm. So, Tets he might have been talking to Tetsuya who then put the hit on her. But then again, if that's in 2188, would it even be talking about any of the things we've seen so far? I mean, he wants to kill Moramura, but is he talking about Moramura from any of the timelines we've seen now? Is he talking about Moramura from 2188? Whichever one started Project Aegis. Yeah. The other person on the line wasn't recorded. But it's clear enough what they're talking about. That was an assassination order on Chihiro Morimura. And besides, when A killed Chihiro as a nurse, that, that, I mean, let's just make the assumption that that's what he was talking about, even though I can't, I can't pin that down exactly. A had those orders written out for him. He didn't receive it in a, in a video calm like that. So... It's possible that it, that he was talking to Tetsuya, but Tetsuya put him up to the murder. Yep. But then again, that's even if that particular murder was the same one they're talking about here. Do you think these people can tell the, the, all the, the, like, 12 Chihiros apart? <laughs> the, they might as well have called this 13 Chihiros. <laughs> <laughs> Well, it's not like this could get any more confusing. Maybe we're Chihiro. Maybe we are Chihiro! <laughs> He's Chihiro, she's Chihiro, you're Chihiro, I'm Chihiro! Are there any other Chihiros I should know about? I've been waiting the entire fucking LP for you to finally make that reference. <laughs> Session one! Like, I had, I had star mute the mic to be like, God, I hope she makes the Spongebob reference. And I have been waiting this entire fucking time for it to happen. And it has finally paid off. We haven't That's even so hit the halfway point in the game yet. That's so specific. We haven't. No. We have, we have not. <laughs> <laughs> We're still only around a third the way done with the story parts alone. 
<laughs> I've been waiting this entire time. I can't get over how specific that is. The fact that you knew it was going to be me to make that reference. The fact that you knew I was going to reference SpongeBob specifically. And the exact quote. Yep. <laughs> <laughs> well, LP's over. We're done, folks. <laughs> no! I seem to have called in. <laughs> Is he having a split personality thing with the glasses? I think he's just trying to process what he just saw. So, yeah, a lot to unpack there. Yep. Funny thing is, we still haven't gotten to any of the bombshells I've been waiting for us to get to this recording session. Yep, and as you see, we can't progress more with him until we get at least 80%, 80 with all 12 other students. Yep. It makes so much sense for Renya to be, like, the very final. Yeah. yeah. He's the CEO of Shikishima. Uh, of the 13 Sentinel pilots, he's kind of the one who has the best grasp of what's <laughs> going on for reasons. He, he doesn't probably, have the whole picture. Yeah. He probably has the best grasp of what's going on out of anyone in the universe. Mm -hmm. Not true. I'm talking about his universe, our universe, the multiverse. Still not true. <laughs> They're not okay, not counting the writers. I'm not counting the writers. So there's someone who knows exactly what's going on here. There's definitely someone Everything. at least at least one person who has a much better grasp. I still can't believe how very specifically you wanted me to make that joke. Like, I knew it was going to happen eventually. You, you knew! I, I'm like, come on, <laughs> any minute now. Am I really that easy to read? <laughs> <sighs> how, do, I, do I really make that many Spongebob references? You don't, but it was like, yeah, no, she is going to make that reference. At some point in this LP, this is going to come up, and it's going to be beautiful. Okay. Was it? It was. <laughs> there, there is only one possible way it could have been better, but th this is good. We haven't this is gotten very... to that part where it would have been better, right? I think we potentially could have, but we did not. <laughs> we have not gotten to it yet. So, just something we brought up earlier. The whole, these, both those scenes were in the same lab. Yep. <laughs> just the scene with creating Android Tomy happened four years prior to the scene we just saw. That's the room with Beta Monokuma. Yeah. Go to notice for change in attitude. Oh. So what drugs were they on to make this game? <laughs> yes. <laughs> okay, I'll ask. Do you want to go for one more story bit, or do you want to call it for the night? 
It might be good to call it night. We're getting some bad thunderstorms over here. Yeah, that is true. And I have school tomorrow. I got work tomorrow. I have to clean up the kitchen. And honestly, I think we ended it on the best bit of the LP. <laughs> best bit of the LP so far. This, this is true. <laughs> this, they, they, I, there are a couple of bombshells that I think we could have gotten this recording session, potentially. That, like, Star and I are both like, mm, boy, we can't wait. We'll get there eventually. The <laughs> yeah? Like, your your hands are folded. Like, like your, your chin, like, all, resting on them. Like, 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 the shine in your glasses that you don't have. I used to I used to have glasses. I never wore them though, so I ended up uh, donating them to somebody. Yeah, to the Lions Club. <laughs> yeah, but yes, this is a good. This is a we've we've had a lot of stuff dropped on us, and I think we need some time to process it. Yes, Surratt's hamsters need to go to the titty bar. Yeah, Surratt's hamsters need to go to the titty bar. <clears throat> They're gonna be working. <laughs> Let them see the guinea titties! I have to edit this video! <laughs> <laughs> but anyway, yes. Th this has been yet another recording session of 13 Sentinels Aegis Rim. <laughs> My mind is a fuck. <laughs> I fucking love this game. <laughs> and I will talk to everyone later. <laughs> Good night, everybody. Nothing is real. Until then, take care. Bye-bye. Later. Bye.